got in line right away for merchandise. A night that started off with smiles and excitement quickly took a terrifying turn. We were right by the stairs and the stairs were just Flooded they were among the hundreds who got caught in the middle of this brutal storm. There was, I mean, there was hail everywhere. Forced to take cover under a tree. We were, like crunched down because there was like nowhere to go. And like the hail started pelting us in the back, like head and everywhere, everywhere. And, like put my hand up to cover my head and got slammed in the hand, my fingers like totally swollen. The venue did issue warnings for weather, but the hailstorm moved in so quickly it caught people off guard. There was ambulances coming and tow trucks, like cars were getting stuck. And I mean, we there were like the, some of the cars in the parking lots have their windows busted out. People were screaming and crying. Um, you know, people kept getting separated from each other. In the chaos, her youngest got separated. And then there was this other little girl right next to me, and I kept yelling, um, Deanna, that's my daughter's name, I'm like, where is she, where is she? And the little girl just happened to be named Sienna, and she was like, I'm Sienna. <laughs> yeah. And so I grabbed her hand. Eventually, Yana Shanis was able to reunite the girl with her group and found her own daughter. One of the moms just, like, brought her inside and protected her. She was totally fine. Yana Shanis, on the other hand. Hail puts dents in cars. Like, imagine what it does to your head. Is covered with welts and bruises. If you can imagine, like, getting hit by a golf ball, right? Like, the pain, but having it happen, like... 50 times to your head and your back. They were some of the lucky ones. Paramedics reported seven people were taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. Over 100 were treated at the scene. Reporting in Phoenix, Alexis Dominguez for Arizona's Family.